Hi loves, welcome to my channel, This Mama Loves Disney. Okay, you guys, I have a huge Daiso haul to share. Okay, so the other day I was, um, I was sharing a wand that I made and in my uh, video I had mentioned um, this particular sequence um, in my video and um, so it made me think you know what I'm gonna go check to see if Daiso was open and sure enough Daiso was open and so I decided I had the opportunity to go so I decided to take off now the thing is my Daiso is a two-hour trip just to get there and back so I don't go there very often. So um, I ended up picking up this trim. I'm gonna show you everything that I picked up that is just um, craft related, okay? So I picked up this. I got some of these clear bags, which I always pick up whenever I'm at Daiso, um, just to put Happy Mail in. I picked up some of these, um, they're just like folders. Um, you can see right there how they open up. I thought I would try to see if my fuse tool would work with these. Um, so it's just a thought. If worse comes to worse and it doesn't work, I'll probably use some of my projects and put my projects inside here. Okay. Then, um, I had one of these little, it says, it says a dotting pen. I had one of these that was made out of wood that I've had for so many years, so many years. And I happened to drop it on the ground and, um, or drop it on the floor, not the ground, on the floor. And um, completely forgot it was there. It just must have fell out of something. And I ended up getting it caught in the carpet and it ended up going right into my foot <laughs> so it broke because it was made out of wood so i ended up picking up a couple of these because the reason why i like these sometimes depending on the dies you could punch out the dies it has a round circle at the end and not the point so sometimes it's easier just to push out the dies so i did decide to pick up three of those just to have some extras on hand um yeah and then i love these paper clips um these paper clips have like more of a round, a large rounded edge, and then they have this little square piece, um, like a square edge. And I love when you're putting ribbon on it or you're putting, um, you know, decorating them. It's so easy, it, uh, for whatever reason, when you're using ribbon particularly, it's so easy for it to bond better right there because of the tip. Well, it's not really bonding. I guess it doesn't slide as much. So I love these. So I picked up some more of those. But I love these ones too. So I ended up getting some more of these colored ones. Because I love the metallic colors. Um, because I always use the non-stick scissors um, for my tapes. Um, I decided to pick up an extra pair just to have it on hand. Um, because, you know... Sometimes your the scissors get so full of that gooey stuff from the tape, and they say non-stick, but you know some of them still get sticky. But um, I figured, you know, those moments that I don't have time to clean them, I'll have a backup one. And then these are nail art brushes, but because I'm I've painted, you know, for the, like the longest time, I love to paint. Um, I went ahead and got some of these just for my painting. So I'm hoping that they'll work for painting also. I also have painted nails before. Um, um, a long time ago, I would paint like little, um, uh, scenes like, like, um, beach scenes. And I would put the sand and I put the sunset and I put like little dolphins jumping out and stuff. So I can always use those for that too. And then um, I found this really super pretty um, iridescent, or no, I, I, I guess it's holographic, um, stars ribbon. And then I also found some with hearts. And I just, oh my gosh, I, when I saw these, I just loved them. They had a brighter background um, on one of them, but I like the dark, ground, dark background with these uh, colors because it brings out the colors so much more. 
And then one of these little baskets, I ended up picking up another one of these little baskets. Um, the small little envelopes that I pick up from Amazon and I put some of my dies in fit in here perfect. And plus it gives it a little bit of room on the side so that, you know, you can just kind of sift through them and stuff. So, um, yeah, so, and then right here you have this little area right here where you could put the label on. So I usually get my label maker and I put the labels on there. So I went ahead and picked up an extra one of those. Okay. And then, oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so flipping excited over this next product. Oh my gosh. And I'm going to share it later. Um, but I bought this foam. Um, I don't know if it's foam. Um, what? Okay, so it's like a styrofoam, I guess, in a sense. And you guys, these sheets are, gosh, at least, um, gosh, I want to say, I don't know how many inches. Um, I know when I put a ruler against it, um, I, it was over two rulers long. And then it was about, I think it was about 28 inches, and, um, no, 24 inches wide. So it was over 28 inches long and over 24 inches wide. And it's just huge. I bought black for Halloween. I bought red for um, Christmas and I bought two whites. And oh my gosh, I'm eventually, if I'm in that area or my husband's in that area, cause he, he work sometimes he has to work in that specific uh, area. I told him if you're there, get me some more. Um, oh my gosh, it is a whole new world with shakers. I tell you, oh my goodness. Um, yeah, just amazing. So I made a bunch of shakers yesterday. Um, I didn't glue them all together. I just cut them all out. So yeah, a whole new world, you guys. Okay, so because I, I bought the poster board um, from, not poster board, I'm sorry. I bought the um, uh, foam board from Dollar Tree, but when I made my little bunnies out of that uh, foam board, I had to cut it out at least three times to stack it so that, um, cause you know, once it goes through the machine and the machine flattens it, so I had to do them like three times. So, you know, you're stacking them, plus you have the back, plus you have the front, so it's like a long process. With this one, cut it once and boom. You just decorate it. It's just amazing. Okay, so I ended up finding a bunch of little Hello Kitty stuff. I was so excited. So they have these little kitty containers that you can put little little crafty goodness in. Then there's this little one right here, and it's showing that it holds jewelry. Let's just oh, I was gonna say let's look, but no, it has a tag right there. I don't want to. I don't want to mess it up. But it's showing right there that you can put, it has a little, um, uh, oh, it's right there. It's showing that it's removable. But it's showing that it has like a little foam holder where you can just slip your jewelry inside there. So that is just super cute. I get that. Found some adorable, cute little Hello Kitty bags. Got two different sets of bags. Um, one's a 10 pack and one's a 15 pack. Found this little book cover with um, a, it says with a slider. So let me, I I want to show you this because I was really curious. I didn't open it in the store with the whole COVID thing because I wanted to see what you know what it was all about. So this is removable, this ribbon. So if I wanted to put this ribbon in the in the oven and go ahead and um, make it you know with little ringlets, I can do that. But it has a little pocket right here where you can slide it open. This would be really cute to put a shaker mix inside there. You can just put one of those clear bags, one of these clear bags in here, fill it up with a shaker mix and just put it inside there. That would be a great idea. So if you wanted to switch it out with something else later, you can do it. But this is like, um, you can use this either as a cover or you can um, actually use it as an insert for um, a traveler's notebook. And you have a little pocket right here you have a back pocket right here, and then you have two smaller pockets right here, and then you have a little um, pen holder right there, a little area to slip your pen. It's just so cute. I think this might have to go on my wish list if I can make it there again, and they have these. The thing is with Daiso, you never know if they're going to have the same products um, when you go in again. Um, 
it's just one of those, you know, you never know. Okay. And then, so that was Unicorn. And then this one was really cute. These little bags. Um, they have little cupcake, uni unicorn cupcakes, and then they have little carousel horses, and I love carousel horses. I used to collect some carousel horses a long time ago, so this is really, really super cute. It says, today is a perfect day, and then it says sweet all over it, but really super cute bags. Okay, so I got those. And then... I bought two of these really big containers. These, these now, you know, everything at Dice is $1.50 each. But these containers, these big, huge, clear containers, ended up being um, $3. So I ended up getting two of these. I love the openings. The openings are really nice. It's a nice, sturdy container. So let me show you all the fun goodness in here. This is a Disney box. So it is full of Disney. Um, these are little covers that you would put over your, um, silicone covers that you would put over like tea, if you were, or tea or oatmeal, if you wanted to put it in a cup, just to keep the steam inside there. So they had little Mickey heads on them. This one had Mickey heads on it with a little jewel. You can see the jewel sticking up. And this one had, um, a flower pattern with little tiny Mickey heads in it. And then of course it has the little, um, holder right here that has a Mickey and then I found this little um, it says it's a popsicle maker so it had Minnie Mouse I thought how cute is that and I don't you could probably use it some uh, for something else other than a popsicle maker so I went ahead and picked up that then I found these little hooks they say that they're car hanging hooks for the back of the car but I thought um, I, I just have a million different ideas of what I can use these for. So um, I went ahead and picked those up. Then I found these adorable little tweezers that have Mickey Mouse on there with some little hearts. I thought those were adorable. I had to get those. And then they had washi that was um, Alice in Wonderland washi. Um, it says the ra uh, rap. It says rabbit in Wonderland. It has the um, the Mad Hatter's little hat. It has some roses on it. It has the little teacups, and then it has the little bunny right there. And then you get a bonus because you get Christmas. I'm oh, excuse me, not Christmas. You get birthday um, um, washi as well. And then I picked up some um, Finding Nemo washi. Well, actually, I think it's uh, Dory's movie because there is the whale in that one. I think it's Bailey the whale. And then there was Toy Story washi right here. That was really cute. I picked that up. Then I found this princess container that was super cute. Um, I loved it because it has sections so I just could not pass that one up. I just thought, how adorable is that? I should have got a couple of them so that they can stack on top of each other and just keep some goodies in it. So I picked up that. I found this really super cute um, Minnie Mouse notebook. It has lined paper in it, and I thought that would be really cute just to put some um, notes in there of my crafting ideas. And then I found this cute box. They had two of these clear acrylic boxes. Um, they had this size and then they had a smaller of the size. But I thought, you know, for $1.50, let me go with the larger size, fit more stuff in it. Then I found these super cute little note cards and um, I don't know if they're envelopes too. You know, it's sad because I cannot read Japanese but okay I see it there it is there is there's five envelopes okay and then there's five little note cards <laughs> I was looking over here in this area but yeah so those are really super cute then I found these cute Mickey Mouse bags those are super cute and it's this Mickey Mouse on there and they're the clear little bags and these are just so adorable look at these little puffy stickers Oh, just sweets and fruits and mm, just deliciousness. Yeah, I thought those were really super cute. 
And then I found this cute um, bag. It's just like, um, you can use it for pencils, you can use it for notes. I mean, not notes, but you know, you can just keep a lot of little odds and ends. Um, you could put one in your car, you can, you know, use one when you're traveling to put your makeup in. There's all, I mean, and if you have a big enough purse, um, you could put it in your purse. And it has um, Belle, Sleeping Beauty, and Ariel on there. And then it has um, a mesh, clear mesh on the other side so you can actually see what's inside the bag. Then I got some of these um, folder folders that are like a pocket folder. So, I mean, you know what? Let me see something. I don't know if, I'm just gonna double check please. I don't know if it's sealed on the edges or how it is exactly. Let's see. So it opens, oh, it has a little Velcro dot. And then it opens, okay, I see. So you can slip stuff inside here. Oh my gosh, how cool is that? Okay, cool. I can slip projects in here and then just keep them um, all together. That's gonna be perfect for what I did with the foam because I have so many different uh, foam um, cutouts that I did recently um, that I can put all the different ones in each pocket. And then I bought one that was Mickey. Um, I found these cute little Alice in Wonderland blot, um, blotting pads. Um, I thought those were really cute. And then, last but not least, I found some earrings. Okay, so I found these little, um, rose gold earrings and they have like a little Mickey head right there and then there's a little tiny bow on this side and then there's little Mickey Mickey heads that hang and um, yeah so I found one of those and then I got three of these there was only three left and I bought all three um, they're earrings but I don't think I'm gonna use them for earrings I think I'm gonna take those little tiny cute charms off and use them for little you know I don't know just little charms on stuff so you have Mickey's little pants his shoe his little little Mickey um, outline um, you have Minnie's shoe you have a heart and then you have the outline of Minnie's head so yeah so that is my huge Daiso um, haul I had so much fun. I <laughs> I have no idea how long I was in that store because I hadn't been there in so long. And I was going through, I was putting stuff in my cart, taking stuff out because it was like, okay, you know, we got too much. But yeah, I had a blast. Okay, you guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. And I hope you guys um, enjoyed spending some time with me today. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.